Life is amazing. What good is it a man dates a whole world and yet That's Hunter. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a where have I been slash vlog channel. Um, I wanted to go here one day. Go here for a little little pizza. The pizza better be good. I'm not gonna lie, this light right here is so dangerous to turn left into there because like it's like a blind spot right here, right? So it's like when you're at that light, you see how like we could see this, but when you're at that you can't see that. So Carl, should I park behind there? You could park behind there. Um, when Carl, I'm going to get her and coffee is a crazy mix. I guess it's because the combo, but later on, I'm not, I'm not tripping. There you go. We got vanilla. Cold and I got vanilla hot whole milk. You got almond milk? I got almond milk. I'm about to be even. I'm gonna taste this. I think I might need some sugar. Can you grab some sugar? So I got the regular bagel, egg, cheese, ham, cheese, and cheese. Cheese, 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 it wasn't bad. It just felt like we could have made it, and I think because we went so simple. Yeah, we gotta start doing that. When we go like out the places, we gotta get like their special stuff. Like, That's the first we're time. We're getting the same thing. We, we got the same thing we could have made. You could have made something different. I went, I went off your order, Jit. Hey, you could have got something different. I went off your order, though. I gotta be saying because I have a you're reason. Mad. Oh, you at you. I don't like that, bro. Anyways, he, he gotta the same thing off of me. Like, I ordered first. You could have thought of something else. Yeah, you're right. Man. We could have just split it. My bad. It's like, ain't got the same type of flavor. Um, I hate too. but damn, $34. I mean, when you think about it, that's enough food, though. That's a coffee, a Gatorade, a hash browns, yeah, and but, a bangle. Yeah, but true. But it's like. Yeah. We, we, we could make that for a whole two weeks. But that's the My thing, though. It, it was effort. any sandwich, so you could have got more things on your sandwich. We just went the basic way. The thing was right in front of you. You, no, you not box. No, no, I grab for the people. Like, That's you know. not acting. I'm saying. Yeah, you know my. Good morning, guys. It is Sunday. Um, I don't even know what day it is. The twenty-first, and I'm about to get ready for church. We have two service now. Our nine thirty, nine nine o'clock, and eleven thirty. And then I normally go to the first service just so I can have more time in the day. Um, I didn't, I do miss when they had the one service, but hey, I'm not the owner of the church, neither am I the people who do the hours. So, why do we get ready? It's currently like just turning eight o'clock, so and I don't live that far from church, so I'm gonna do what I gotta do. And you guys are gonna come to church with me, and I'm just gonna pick it up for whatever happens after the church. I always cover my mirrors at night because I don't have time for that. I mean, I don't have time for that. You know, there are certain things they're saying, like, you know, spiritual things. And I just don't associate with stuff like that. So, I hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend. And this is going to be the start of my vlog. Yesterday, I was out with my fiance. And we were just doing things we were what we wanted to do. We wanted to try the new school, so I, we were supposed to go to my friend's birthday, but he didn't feel like driving, and I didn't feel like driving, so we just came back home and like watched the movie and went to sleep and did some homework. But that was just it from yesterday. It was nothing. I didn't pick up back after I went to that place to go look where our baby shower was, but that was just it, y'all.
It was really spectacular. But yeah, I have so much to talk about you guys when I get back from church. So let me just go get ready first. So y'all, I am all set and ready to go to church. I'm gonna take this off my hair. I just wanted to make sure my my ponytail is gonna be laying flat. Like I said, it's like 851, but church is like 10 minutes away from me. So it won't be too bad. And not and there's not really no traffic. Well, I'm waiting all this time and I could have just went away. Yeah. My sister's already there um, because she drives slower than me and she wanted to leave the house early, but I wasn't ready. So we just went our different ways. So yeah, I'm just gonna meet her up there and I'm gonna show you guys. I mean, you guys know how church is and everything. So there's nothing for really, really much for y'all to show. It's just the same old, same old, but two services now. I see a lot of churches are doing their two services. And they used to do the two service too, but um, we had a moment when the Holy Spirit just came in rushing in. It was William and Dow that came to our church and shift the atmosphere. And they were like, yeah, we need more time at church. So they went to a one service and it lasted for like a year and some change. And then they finally decided that um, they're going back to their regular two program just because our church was being overflowed. It was packed, um, traffic of getting in and out was a little too crazy. And they just made that executive decision and decided, yeah, we're going back to two service, which is not bad because it kind of helps those who probably would work early to come and those who go to work later to come early. So that's pretty much it. Now. To bear. I've got to crucify it on an altar and allow God to do a work. And so it says, take up the cross, follow me. Whoever wants to save his life will lose it. But whoever loses his life for me will save it. What good is it a man gains the whole world and yet lose or forfeit his very self? If anyone is ashamed. Alright, so I just got out of church. My there's something no i just got a church and i'm about to go to Publix to go get some groceries nothing too major just something to keep me up for this week and turn this ac now you're gonna hear straight ac real close to my car please So I just finished putting all the stuff away in the refrigerator and I'm about to make my lunch for tomorrow. <clears throat> I'm gonna make me some mashed potatoes, some chicken wings, and some broccoli. Something very easy because I don't feel like cooking. And I'm just in the process of like cleaning the cleaning the chicken wings and do what I have to do. Your girl is really thirsty right now. Hey guys, um, welcome back to my channel. I'm currently going to my doctor's appointment, my prenatal doctor's appointment for guys who don't know. I am pregnant and I'm going to be documenting my journey now. At first, I didn't feel too comfortable vlogging on my journey. I just wanted to make sure that everything was going to be okay. But now that I'm in a safe zone, I want to share my journey with you guys and i can't wait for you guys to tune in and watch with me um it's been a good journey i cannot complain i have the most amazing amazing man that's taking care of me and making sure that our baby is going to be healthy and is getting everything that they're needed um i'm about to be a little late for my appointment because i live on a main road in a sense so these cars don't like to stop and the way that they drive in south florida if you live in, in south florida oh, um the way we in florida drivers are they're horrible they can care less about you listen you're just a check to them they will smash your car and then try to claim whatever they want to claim with their insurance so yeah guys i am just getting ready to go there's so much to that I did not talk about that you guys are probably gonna be like, what the heck did we just miss? You missed a lot, sweetie. <clears throat> yeah, you just missed a lot. If you follow me on Instagram, then you know <clears throat> me being catching up. Sorry, y'all. 
if you follow me on Instagram, then you know what's been going on because I've been posting things on Instagram, but not so much on my other social media platform like TikTok and YouTube. But I am pregnant. I got engaged as well. So everything has been going really good in 2024 by the glory and the grace of God. Like everything that he has done in my life is just coming Everything I prayed for it as well, too, is just coming to pass, too, in 2024. And in the beginning of this year, there was this pastor who came to our church. His name is Pastor Moses. And he said, it shall end in praise. 2024 will be a year that it ends in praise. And all the time, um, I am just very happy, honestly. I'm very pleased and content. Even though some areas of my life are not where I would like it to be, but I know that it's going to come to pass. Like, it shall end in praise. Regardless of how the beginning of the year started, the ending of your year shall end in praise. In Jesus' name, we seal that with the blood. But I am talking so much. Y'all getting out of breath, y'all. Y'all don't even understand. There are so many pregnancy symptoms and things that I did not know about beforehand that I'm not figuring out. Because, you know, sometimes people don't really tell you the things about pregnancy. And I know they said that being out of breath was one thing, but it's, it's really a thing. I am, like, out of breath all the time. Especially when I'm laying down. I can literally hear myself, like, huffing and puffing. And I'm just looking at my man. He's just like, yeah, it's okay. And I'm like, no, it's not. <laughs> I sound like, oh, well. But, yeah, guys, let me pick up with you guys when I get there. I just feel like I'm blabbing right now. Hey guys, so I'm currently home. Um, I didn't really record much at the doctor's appointment because it was just nothing really. They just checked the baby's heartbeat and he's doing pretty good, which is somewhat spectacular. But it's nothing really going on today. So I just got home. I made, me, I made myself some breakfast, just tidy up my room. And now I'm just gonna chill and watch me some TV. Abbott Elementary just came out the new season so i'm gonna watch that episode as well as homecoming did come out two days ago so i'm gonna watch that again it is really windy outside we're supposed to have a hurricane and if you're a floridian you already know it's not gonna happen for real so we just got just like some strong gusts of wind we had this rain this morning that was honestly i thought it was the hurricane gonna come but he said no Helen said, girl, no, bye. She went the other direction. So it's pretty good for those who live in South Florida, but I don't know about Northern Florida because I think Tallahassee and Tampa got hit real hard. So if you live there, I hope everything is still doing well for you guys and I hope you guys were safe and, you know, there was no major damage. Um, but other than that, yeah, like I said, there ain't really much going on. I have things going on the weekend, so I'm going to pick it up again. And... I have my photo shoot, my mom's birthday. No, I had the hurricane coming, so we're still gonna do what we're gonna go do. And yeah, I'm gonna take you guys to my photo shoot and get my hair done, do my makeup, and all of that good stuff. So yeah, this is where I'm at now. I know, guys, this is oh, when I do my makeup, I'm gonna tell you guys everything about um how this all happened and you know far along and take you guys with me because this is my new life so you're gonna have to watch me like this regardless so hey girls good morning oh well, hey rupees good morning it's currently saturday and i'm about to head out to go run a quick little errand tomorrow's my mom's birthday and she's doing a little photo shoot this afternoon so i'm gonna go buy her a dress and just get her some nails because i'm a nail tech and I can't do her nose because, you know, there's a bun in my oven. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to buy her some nose for her to put on. And do I have to do her hair today? And I have to do my hair today because my photo shoot is tomorrow. So it's kind of like a busy day in a sense. I'm going to take you guys along with me. I'm going to go to Marshall's to go find her a dress for her to wear. My brother's taking her out for dinner on Monday. So she also needs an outfit for that. 
and yeah i'm gonna just take y'all along with me it's currently i think just turned 10 and everybody's pretty much out right now my mom went to her cousin's house to go grab something my sister went to a baptism to go do well my sister went to baptism and my brothers are at work and it's just a pretty chill day <sighs> yeah i be so out of breath it is so crazy but it's almost time for a little pumpkin to come out and i can't wait to see him i can't wait to meet him and hold him and sniff him <sighs> the joys of being a mom i wouldn't i wouldn't replace it for anything Anyways, here you guys, I am currently in my nail area. I'm about to do some press on nails for me. You okay? I'm about to do some press on nails for me. Um, probably later on, because I have to do my mom's hair. She's not here, and I have to do my hair. So I'm just probably going to finish doing my toes. I'm going to do some, like, fall look, because I just wanted to be some fall nails. Honestly, I was going to do regular just white nails, but I was like, oh, let me do some designs. Let me do some designs because I haven't done any designs lately and I'm just trying to make sure I still got my skills because it's been a while since I touched my nose. I think it's been since April, May, May or June, one of them, can't really remember. So I just want to make sure I'm picking up the pace. And sorry y'all if I sound real stuffy, but there's something in this nail room that's making me sneeze and I think it's the dust or something. So I probably feel like I need to clean up. Cause it's no bueno. But yeah, for those who haven't seen, this is my nail room and everything, of course. But yeah, my little so baby. Yeah, this is it. Oh my god! Hey y'all, so I'm, I'm about to start woman. doing my hair. Got this thirty inch off of Amazon. Five, they um, the tomorrow I'm just gonna do some like curls to it, but I'm just gonna block it on my head for right now, but. I got other stuff that I need to be really doing. Stand to smooth that rough touch with a I'm not kiss. doing the bulk hair method because a lot of times when I on the same thing, not my favorite thing to do. Let me go get my tripod stand real quick. This is how it's looking so far. This is the side part. But I did not curl it or anything. I'm gonna probably do a curl tomorrow morning. I don't like to see with the things in my head. So it's like seven o'clock, which is crazy, but I'm tired. I don't think I can continue anymore. I know I have some fix up to do over here. 
and blending that part. I'm probably plucking this area a little bit just to give it more definition to the swoop. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I think I'm gonna end it for tonight here. I'm not too sure what I wanna do because I have to fix my clothes that are in my room. And I have some homework I need to do. So I was gonna start that, send it to the person I'm working with and see what she says and probably just end it right there. I'm tired. And I bought this stuff at Marshall's. And honestly, I bought this, well, I went to Marshall's around like 12, I think. And the ice that I put in here after I purchased this is still in here. So it's been pretty good. And it was like $14, $16 and tax with everything. But yeah, get you one of these. And it's cute, it's pink. I wish you had, there was a black one, but hey, I'm gonna do what I gotta do, boo boo. It is what it is. But tomorrow is the day of the photo shoot. I did my nails. I did not do my toes yet. I just need to clean up my eyebrows. And what else do I need to do? I think that's pretty much it. But give me a moment. morning guys it is Saturday it is Sunday and it's my photo shoot day so I'm gonna take you guys along with me I'm about to do my skincare off camera but I'm gonna record some parts of me doing my makeup with you guys as well as doing my hair um it's my mother's birthday as you seen the clip that I added before we just saw her happy birthday made her little breakfast and whatnot and then put her little gifts on the table she went to church I didn't go to church today because the timing of church ending would clash with the time of my photo shoot. And we're just going to go out later on today for my mom's birthday. But I'm going to pick up with you guys when I start doing my makeup and do my skin routine off camera. <laughs> Do 
Keisha. You might have probably had to split this one into two. How you feel? You never sent a message to the baby. Good, man. I can't wait to get here so I can play ball with you. You know what I'm saying? I'm dad still with you, so I can't wait to sign. All right. Any last words? One more word. Last word. We going to the league. We go. So I'm not gonna speak to you like you're from Broward because I mean your mother and father's from Broward, but you're not from Broward, okay? You're a child of God and you're loved, you're cherished, valued. So don't let no one speak to you like you know, like okay. Leave it alone. You're so loved. I know your head big, but you're so loved. Okay? Listen, this here. What's up? Let's go. We here. Hey guys, so coming back from the photo shoot. I just took on my lashes. It was a success. Videos are cute. I'm gonna insert some clips just so you guys can see. Yeah, my face is like all types of caking up and everything. Really. But I'm about to wash my face and lay down and we're about to head out again tonight to go for me for my mom's birthday. And I'll just take it up and show you guys what we're doing there. My baby is moving a lot. He is enjoying his time in there. And I just need to lay down right now. Yeah, I gotta have a lay down quick. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>